Well, great job by Virginia today. Uh, you know, they were the better ball team. Um, we certainly did a good job of competing uh, through seven innings. Uh, but, uh, you know, they were just a little bit better there at the end of the ball game. You know, the eighth inning kind of, um, you know, fell apart for us a little bit. A couple of free 90s. And then, obviously, uh, Newell hit the big three-run homer to give them their second big inning of the day. Um, really proud of Keyshawn Askew. I thought he battled. He really did. You know, he wasn't probably at his best, uh, you know, over his last couple starts. He got hit some today. Uh, had some tough luck. Uh, some ground balls that got through the infield for some hits. Uh, but, um, you know, the one thing that I, I – and that was in the second inning, but I was very impressed with Keyshawn just staying staying in the ball game, keeping us in the ball game, and uh, he can, just kept competing. Uh, so very, very proud of him. Also very proud of Ryan Ammons. Got it. You know, he hadn't gotten a lot of opportunities where, where we need somebody, somebody else in the bullpen to step up for us. And Ryan Ammons, you know, comes in bases loaded with one out, gets a huge punch out, uh, then gets a 3-0 count on the next guy and throws three straight strikes, you know, and uh, just really proud of Ryan. Um, you know, and offensively, we just chipped away. Uh, you know, we're down 3 nothing, and it was 3-1 to one and 3-2 to two and 3-3 three to three and uh, but, you know, at the end of the day, uh, Virginia was just a better club and, uh, and they won the game. Coach Alex Dodd from the Clemson Insider. Uh, do you feel like in your bullpen uh, towards the end of the game, you, you mentioned that things kind of fell apart. Do you feel like they just kind of fed off of uh, what Virginia was doing and it gave you some bad momentum there at the end of the game? Uh, you know, I don't know. I, I just think they, they put together some good at-bats. You know, quite honestly, they hit the home run. You know, we, uh, we had tied the ball game in the sixth, and, uh, you know, they came back out in the seventh, and, you know, leadoff guy hit a home run. Um, and, uh, you know, then, you know, after that, we made some changes in the eighth. We wanted to get Clayton out of the game. We didn't want to burn him uh, for the weekend. We wanted him available tomorrow. So, um, you know, but the bottom line is, is um, – you know, they were, they were a little better offensively uh, than us today. We were the better team by far yesterday. And, you know, they were a little bit better than us today. And, um, you know, you give them credit. I think uh, you could definitely tell that from a momentum standpoint, an offensive momentum standpoint, they, were, they took better swings today and, and had better at-bats today. Uh, so, um, so, yeah, I mean, you give them credit. You know, they were, they were aggressive and, uh, you know, put together better at-bats overall, you know, than we did today. And how important is tomorrow's game, just getting back uh, on the right track and continuing a lot of the momentum you guys have in conference play? It's, it's very important. I mean, we want to win the series. We're at home, and uh, we have been playing well. I think we've won three series in a row, and we'd certainly want to make it fourth. Uh, we're going to have to dig deep tomorrow. You know, Hoffman's going to need to be good for us, and we've got Gilbert that we can use for multiple innings tomorrow. Clayton will be available. I mean, we've got everybody available. I don't think we've burned anybody as far as bullpen guys, maybe uh, outside of a Matt Clark, not sure if he'll be available, but we'll have plenty of options, but you know, we, we need to come out and swing the bats and play well tomorrow. And, uh, and uh, you know, hopefully, uh, you know, we'll, we'll play better baseball tomorrow and find a way to win the series. Anything else for coach Lee? All right. Thanks, Coach. Thanks. Okay, last stop is Kier Meredith. Go ahead with questions. Kier, Alex Dodd from the Clemson Insider. Uh, what was working for you particularly offensively today and how did it feel to see that ball leave the yard? Uh, yeah, I was in the ball well tonight. Um, just trying to stay up the middle. Uh, and it felt good. Uh, yeah, I was just in the ball well tonight and try to keep things simple. What's the mood in the dugout looking forward to a, a big rubber match game tomorrow uh, in conference play? Uh, the guys are excited. It's um, going to be a challenge tomorrow. Um, it's a big game. We won three ACC series in a row. Um, and we want to win our fourth tomorrow, so the guys are excited. And we'll, we'll show up in the morning ready to roll. What was it in particular that uh, Bales was doing at the end of the game that made him uh, so difficult to hit out of the bullpen for Virginia? Uh, you know, I'm not sure. Uh, I knew coming in, Bales had good stuff. Uh, I wasn't able to see him. Uh, but so, yeah, I'm not sure what, what exactly it was. Anything else for Kier?